Hello everybody, welcome to our Once Human Survival Guide. We are doing the Dayton Hospital Exploration Guide today. We have basically uh, come up this road right here, and this is the Dayton Hospital here. So uh, let's get into this because there are a few kind of places that are tricky to find. You can kind of feel like you're going in a maze. So first we're going to go after gear crate number one. Uh, which we're just going to run down this road. The Rift Anchor is obviously to our left, but we're actually going to head to the right, just kind of like in this plaza. Now, there is a Mimic Chest right here in front of the statue, so feel free to grab that slash beware of that. And we'll find the Gear Chest number one right behind the statue. Now, this one took me a little bit to find. It, it, tends, to, it tends to hide, let's just say that. Now, we're going to go get the Rift Anchor, which is conveniently right across the way now you do have to defeat 15 enemies as well to complete this exploration guide very easy to do because there are plenty of enemies around all right we have acti activated the, the rift anchor we're going to now head towards the hospital where we will find both the mystical crate and uh the second gear crate so here is the hospital basically we're going to go ahead I guess we'll go in this entrance, and I might end up confusing myself because this is not the way I went in last time. But we're going to do what we can here. But the goal, basically, is to climb upwards. Now, there's definitely a lot of health items that you can find here, so do take your time. Um, I'm just trying to go as straight as a, a possible kind of um, path as, as I can. I get, let's go, I think it's this, well, I want to say it's this way. If you head through the front doors there, go across. Yep, we're looking good so far. And again, like I said, just kind of make sure you keep getting um, all these medical things. There's also a lot of... Uh, I did not go the right way. Gosh darn it, I knew it! But no, uh, there's a lot of um, uh, items here to, to get, especially medical items. So, you know, feel free to, to, to stock up here. Because that's honestly kind of like what this is for. Alright, we're back where we were. We went up the stairs. All right, we're going to go this way instead. <laughs> All right, there's a spotlight guy. Let's get him. Ah, yes, yeah, this is the way we're supposed to go. All right, so it's gear number two. We're going to go ahead and head out on this balcony. And here is gear crate number two. Amazing. Now we're going to go ahead after the mystical crate, which is at the top of the hospital where the helicopter pad is, or was rather. So we're just going to go back from where uh, the from where uh, the, the gear crate was. We're going to keep going up. And that's, like I said, the, kind of the goal here is to just keep going upwards. Now there is a uh, broken door, which we have to kind of go through. So what we'll do is we'll go through here, and then we're going to go on right here through the helicopter room through the broken door out here hello everyone hello all right and then again we're gonna go right up the stairs some more and this place very much is like a maze so we have this here and then if we just turn to the uh the right we'll kill this guy but we have found our beautiful crate Whew! and there it is All right, and that is our uh, exploration guide. Other than that brief little turnaround, you know, not bad. But this place is very much like a maze, and it's very easy to miss that that crate by the statue. So uh, hopefully you found this a little bit more helpful, uh, save you a little bit of time. That's my hope anyway. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I will see you in the next one. Until then, keep surviving and keep thriving.